So with this update, there's a new achievement. It's actually a hidden achievement. So you see this right here. Just a bunch of question marks. But I know what it is. If, in case you can't see the rewards, it's a crit monkey, sharpshooter, and a roll monkey that can now crit. So uh, that's the achievement we're going for. This achievement is to get 25,000 critical hits. And I want to add a challenge on top of that. I want to see how quickly I can get that. Not in terms of time, but in terms of the round. So right now I have 0 out of 25k crits. And I think the best way to do it is to first go on logs, and we're going to play alternate balloons rounds. We're going for the earliest round possible. So again, there's only two different towers that can do critical hits. There's the, um, you know, crossbow master and the tier 4 of it, and there's the roll monkey. In terms of what's more efficient, uh, I looked, I did like a quick one minute test, and it's 100% roll monkeys. Like, the sharpshooters shoot too slowly, and uh, yeah, the zero monkeys shoot really fast, and they crit every... 20 shots or so, so you definitely want to basically spam all those. You just want to spam 0 3 zeros, nothing more. And the reason why you want ABR is because there's more bluens in ABR than there are in normal rounds, so that means your the round you get it on will be lower, because if you only use uh, the crit monkeys for damage, then, well, if there's more bloons in a round, then it'll take more crits, or more shots equals more crits to beat that round. If that makes any sense. So I'm not going to even bother with a Dart Monkey, like a Sharpshooter. I'm just going to basically farm as quickly as I can for a 0-3-0 Roll Monkey, and then go from there. You don't want to cross path it, because, well, technically, if you're talking about, like, efficiency, you'll get more crits with a weaker 0-3-0 than a powered up 2-3-0. Because a 2-3-0 is um, double the attack speed, but also gives Pierce. So, you, you don't want that. You just want the weakest shots that can also crit. 25 crits isn't a lot. Well, it would be a lot if not for the roll monkey change, but because roll monkeys shoot so fast, they crit so often, I think the two crits, because they crit simultaneously. If one arm crits, the other one crits. I do believe that counts as two, but uh, I could be mistaken about that. Oh yes, also no rigor farming. That's obviously a cheese and would be very boring to do. So yeah, I should add no... Uh, None of that. We're just basically spamming 0 3 zeros. Ideally not um, Rigo Farming. I need to get this for leads. Whoops. The plan is, I think we're just going to go for a couple marked places, and then I'll sell those for uh, um, a Super Monkey. Whenever the money is there. So, let's see. On hard mode, Rome Monkey costs like what? A little over 10k? I'm pretty much almost at that amount. So, let's get ready. Okay, it's actually closer to like 14,000. So, never mind. I think I'll go for uh, two marketplaces. Yeah, two marketplaces, and then we can probably save up. I'm gonna even do a gamer move and discount my Super Monkey. It's absolutely worth it. Since, the again, the tiers are very expensive on it. So, it's Super Monkey. We're just gonna sell it. Again, we're trying to rush it. So, basically, at zero, 030. Zero. Um, I gotta give a camo. I guess I'll just do like a 300 zero, zero, zero sub. And, in fact, I'll sell the other towers too. Well, I'll keep the sniper because lead. But yeah, here we go. Let the crits begin. So again, this is what I'm talking about. I think this counts as two crits. Or like, yeah, whenever it shoots in a burst. Whatever, if it shows as a crit, then it counts. At least I think. The only thing you want to buff this thing with is, yes, yeah, just attack speed. You don't want to give it any damage buffs, because then that would uh, increase the uh, damage of it, and thus less total amount of shots I can crit in a round, if that makes sense. So eventually I do want to buy a mid, but I'll buy a jungle jumps in for now. Because that, well, helps. Also, I think that might be worth selling Ben eventually. Because if he trojans a Moab, that means even less attacks you can get. But for now, I'm going to keep farming with, well, the 1030. If I'm not going for damage, you can also do bomb cross path. That, yep, that is correct. This, I mean, yeah, it doesn't really matter. You can totally buy this. In fact, I'll buy it because I said monkey. We'll have at least one of them on the field. I think we want to go for a MIB now, though, just so I can get rid of the sniper. So let's do that. Money most likely won't be an issue, because again, um, we can farm up a lot of logs, that's for sure. So I just want to get, the, you know, the most I can, starting off. You think it's time? Yeah, we got the MIB, so I'm going to get rid of even Ben, even this early on. Although I could keep Barbara selling Ben. And just get, like, sell him again once he gets level 7, but I'll save the hassle and just 
leave him gone entirely. So let me just go for one more of these, and again, we'll get another one soon. I will check the progress after a certain round. Like, I'll, I'll say after round 80. We'll hit around 80 and see how much, how many crits, well, the Super Monkey's well gone also. Forgot about that guy too. Definitely want to get rid of him. So honestly, compared to like 3,000 hooks achievement, this is very easy to get. Granted, the 3,000 hook achievement is very easy to get now, but back when I tried to grind for it, even like that and the, um, what do you call it, D fortify X amount of DTs, I think it's like 3,000. That was a pain in the ass to get. It took like, what, 250 rounds? Apparently this you can get within like 100 rounds, but again, I guess we'll see exactly once we, well, check our progress after 80 rounds. Yeah, just look at how many crits we're getting per round. It's like at least 100, right? And it's only round 52. Now one thing I'm not getting is called arms. This increases, again, pierce, and anything that gives, that offers a buff other than attack speed will decrease the amount of, you know, crits I'll get in a round. So, if, I mean, I could also overclock if I really don't want to keep spamming super monkeys, but since there's so much space on this map, I don't see any reason not to keep spamming these guys. So let's keep doing that. Actually, I'm kind of curious. We'll do a round 60 check. How many crits do we have towards each man around 60? Let's see, let's see. Okay, only 4%. So that's only 1,000 crits. Hmm. Expect a little more, but I guess hey, we're just getting started here in the first 60 rounds. Oh yeah, technically you could lower the round by doing it in a balloon areas run, but um, I've chosen not to do that. We're just going to do standard game modes. And so, again, ABR would be the lowest, or maybe Apocalypse, but I, again, don't think in the 90s there's more RB per round in Apocalypse than there is on ABR, but again, it could be wrong. Robo number 5. 25 crit crits, how quickly can you get those? I can tell we're getting hundreds per round. Again, if each crit visual counts as one, even the ZMG here, oh yeah, that's a lot. That is a, that must be hundreds of crits per round. We must be getting at least 1% per round at this rate, maybe even 2% or 3. Again, ABR is so much better because double the zoom Ds equals double the crits. Fortified bad, same thing. Almost double the crits. So first off, GG. You definitely want to press free play, otherwise the save will disappear. So let me do that first. And then get back out and then check our progress. How much do you think we're at? 20. Alright. So 16% from rounds uh, 61 to 80. That's 6,400 crits between those 20 rounds. Let's see how quickly we accelerate. So we're gonna check every 10 rounds now. Okay, apparently, uh, yeah. ABR does not have actual, like, coded rounds past round 100. So that means I might get random rounds, which may or may not be easier than normal rounds. So maybe... Oh crap, it's actually past round 90. Hold on. Let me back out. How much in that... Oh, wow. We doubled that in 10 rounds, guys. We're up to 40 now. There's actually 4,000 pops or crits between 61-80 and 5,000 now in the last 10 rounds. So you can see it wrapping up quite a bit. So basically we should expect over 60%, 100% um, up to 100. Also, we are actually falling behind just some balloons here. Let me just get a few more of these then. Yeah, I'm going to start building an army over here because I said so. Just to make the rounds go even faster. We'll get one of this, another one of these, uh, it's probably good for now. This again should be enough to beat 100 rounds here, because it's logs. Like look, look how many crits we're getting per round here. At least a thousand, right? So many crit visuals. They don't have to be in a single game again, I'm just doing a challenge. But with it being so easy, why wouldn't you just spend like half an hour getting it in a single game? Because right now it hasn't even been half an hour. This achievement is actually, uh... I think pretty fair. I don't think it's... Well, I guess secret achievements don't have to be uh, hard to get. But I feel like this could just be a regular achievement. Just like the 3000 D fortifies or the 3000 hooks. Because, as you see, there's not... It, it feels similar in terms of, like, trying to get that achievement. So I don't see why it, it should be a hidden, a hidden one. Um, round 96. I feel like I should check between these 10 rounds, but it's okay. I expect... I'm gonna say 80. I'm gonna say, actually more than 80, let's say 83. That's my guess. Because, like, 
The RB in rounds 90 to 100 is way more than 81. 90, I think more than double. So I think we'll be pretty close there. I hope we don't go past 100% then. Then we'll never know what round I got them on. This round is definitely cash money, round 98. Crap ton of crits. Round 100 is going to be money too. Lots of money. Shouldn't be any uh, difficulty beating this. I didn't even like set the targeting of the arm, so... Right now they're popping everything at once with first and last. Generally you want first and close on your, on your robe monkeys, but... Doesn't matter, because again, we have so much money. Each marketplace has paid itself off over three times. Maybe even four times. And here we go. Well, not here we go yet. This is bad. Yeah, look at how free extra RB versus like ABR. You have free bats worth of crits on this round. And another uh, free round of free bat of crits next round. Okay, this F bat is taking a while to pop. Let me just get a few more then. We will pop it, or even without buying more, but I just want to pop it a little bit quicker, because why not? I have so much extra money, no reason not to spend it. So I did say 83%, but I might be underestimating it. I think it's actually more than 83. Can I change my estimate? 89%. Let's say 89. So, around 100. Back out. Okay, no exclamation marks, so we didn't get the achievement yet. 89? Holy crap! 96. <laughs> I underestimated that too. Yo, that's ABR in a nutshell, guys. Apparently, I think I looked... There was a Reddit post somewhere where someone got the achievement on round 108 on normal mode. So, I think one more round and we'll get it. So, ABR is the way, guys, if you want this in the lowest round possible. Let me just see what 101 has. It has to be a good good amount of balloons, so a couple ZMGs. Okay. This could be 4% right here. Yeah, yeah, definitely, okay. I think 101 normal has way less than this. This is 100% the achievement right here. So there it is, guys. Without Riga farming, the earliest possible round is 101 on ABR. Might be faster. It will be faster, actually. Wait, are we gonna die? Don't die. Don't die. It might be faster using bosses, again, but in standard game modes, I think this is the fastest. And there we go, that was fast. Only took half an hour to get this achievement, guys. So there we go. Secret achievement unlocked. Probably one of the easiest secret achievements in the game.